Hey, good evening. This is Alejandro Merbona on behalf of Inglés Corporativo. How's it going, Alison? Good evening. I know. Good. It's final Friday. Yep. Friday. And the body knows it. It's the end of the month. Yeah. Okay. Very good. It's a pleasure for, for us having you here. And uh, we also have Aldo, which is uh, logging in right now. What's up, Aldo? Hello, how are you doing? All good, all good. So guys, thank you very much for being on time. That uh, speaks good about you. I have a question. As you always know, we start the class by talking about yesterday's class. Now, what do you remember about yesterday's class? Just one second, please. Mm -hmm. So pretty much, hey, Marcela, thank you very Hi. much for being here. Mm -hmm. So I'm um, double checking what was yesterday's class topic. Uh, questions. What type of questions? Tag questions. Tag mm -hmm. questions. Tag questions, that's right. Now, um, as I wrote on the, on the forum that I expect everybody, <laughs> you know, to give your opinion, Hello, Andrea. Good to have you here. Yes. Hello, Beth. Good evening. Good evening. So, um, when do we use that questions, guys? When we want to double check an information that we already know. Exactly. So, we wanted to know or confirm something that we already know. Now, what are the three tips that you will give to someone <clears throat> who's trying to learn about tag questions like some tips that you would give them remember that i was asking you for three things at the beginning that was exactly that i don't know right okay <laughs> now, remember, guys, it's not my intention to be rude. However, every single class, you got to review it. Yeah. Because if I ask you something and you're chiefling in the hills, silbando en la loma, then it's going to be very difficult for you to, you know, to improve. So what happens if we have, if we have the statement in affirmative, what happens to the tag? It has to be in negative. It has to be negative. And if the statement is negative, what happens to the tag? It has to be affirmative. Yeah. It has to be affirmative, right? So number one, the number one tip is balance. Affirmative, negative, negative, affirmative. That's right. I know it rings the bell. Me suena, it rings the bell. That's a common expression. And uh, what about the part number two that we have to take into consideration? What do we use in the tag question? Um, can you repeat the question, please? Uh -huh. What do we use in the tag question? Well, that I is just um, huh? the a, a, a pronoun. Aha, uh -huh, the pronoun. That's right. If I am, pronoun. if I'm talking and about Aldo, we use pronoun. He. He. Um, Alison. She. She. My mother and I. We. Exactly. Uh, Andrea and Gladys. They. The school. The house. It. 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 That's right. And what else do we use besides the pronoun? Uh, the auxiliary verb. The auxiliary verb. That's right. What kind of auxiliaries do we have? No, do. Do. Have. Have. Want. No, uh, will. I was will, thinking uh -huh. on want, but. Um, uh huh. Um, we have this. Uh, the these words must, can. Uh huh. Moral verbs. That's right. Moral verbs. And uh, one of the basic ones that we learn when we are is, the verb to be, mm. correct. So 
we have guys uh, in this review, little by little, getting everything back. And what about when we use things like, I am happy? What is the type question for that? For that? Uh, are I? Aren't I? Aren't I? Aren't I? I? Yeah. That's I. right. Excellent. Correct. So let's go ahead and recap. Now everybody, uh, more people is, is actually coming. So let's go ahead and recap. Number one, it must have a? Balance. Balance. Correct. Number two? We need to same use same pronoun and same auxiliary. The same pronoun and same auxiliary. Excellent, Andrea. Number three. Uh, the if the same is negative, it has to be impossible. Uh huh. Negative affirmative, affirmative negative. Correct. And uh, we use this in order for us to confirm. Now, once that you have learned and memorized this, I would recommend you to learn about the intonation. Okay, what kind of intonation do you use whenever you are not sure? Do you remember that? Down first and up. Next. Aha, uh -huh. when you're not sure, down. first you go down and then you go up. And when you are sure? First, up, up, and then down. Exactly. Down. Mm -hmm. That's right. So it's pretty much for you to play with it. Now, any questions about tap questions? All clear. Like I said, water, water. Yeah. Okay. Like horchata. Like, or <laughs> like horchata. All right, guys. So we're going to have a new topic. And this is a mix of uh, questions of the topic that we have been covering throughout the module. And also grammar. Okay. So let's go ahead and get it started. As you know, let's begin. I will be able to. Repeat after me, please. I will be, I able, will to. be able to. I will be able to. Mm -hmm. Explain core elements of the interaction between social media and digital marketing. Explain, Explain core, core elements, elements of the interaction between social media and digital marketing. Digital marketing. Digital marketing. That's right. I need a volunteer to read, please. Mm -hmm. Come on, just one. Me. Go ahead. Uh, I will be that that sentence. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's right. I will be able to explain core elements of the interaction between social media and digital marketing. Nice, nice pronunciation. I liked it, Marcela. Thank you. Question: What is the meaning of core? Core element. Core is. Uh, the center of the center of the principal elements. Uh -huh. That's right. The center of the principal mm -hmm. elements. Now, what is the core product of, uh, I don't know, Cadejo? Beer. That's the core product. Do they sell food? Yes, they do. Do they sell like, um, I don't know, more things like glasses, keychains, etc.? Yeah. Yes, they do. But the principle, the main thing is beer. What is the core product of McDonald's? Hamburgers. Hamburgers. Burgers. Do they sell salad? Yes. Do they sell desserts? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So in this case, under the same principle, guys. Oh, don't even talk about my stories. <laughs> I want I, I want one. I have been wanting a McFlurry for the past like three weeks. Buy so, it. How do you it's say just one life? <laughs> they have a new one, by the way. Oh, don't, don't, don't even start. Girl. <laughs> Did you taste it? <laughs> yes, delicious. How was it? Oh, great. I'm going to buy it this weekend. <laughs> if you continue with that topic, I'm going to take you out of the class, okay? Uh, okay. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> Let's continue to talk questions. <laughs> how, do you, how do you say, guys, when you really want something? I really want it. <laughs> yeah, but there's but there's a word. So one of you asked me for that word in one of the private session. Oh, I think it was crave. That's crave. right, crave. crave. So you can say I have a crave 
for uh, McFlurry. Mm -hmm. So crave is like when you really want to get something like antojo. Supposedly, mm -hmm. uh, women, when they are pregnant, they have cravings. Supposedly. Mm -hmm. It happened to me. I actually got some cravings. Uh, onion rings. That's what got me. But anyways, <laughs> I just wanted to be a part of it. Great, guys. So now that you have learned new vocabulary, let's go ahead and go through this. How does social media marketing influence the sales of product or of a product or service? Read it with me, please. Go. How does social media marketing influence the sales of product or service? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Who wants to answer that question? Yeah. To give your opinion. You don't have to be right. Yeah. Okay, I was sneezing and nobody volunteered. So guys, how does social media marketing influence the sales of a product or service? Do you think that is related? The way that you handle your social media with the amount of sales you can make? Probably. Yeah. Okay, answer because yeah. I have to sneak, a sneeze. Uh, okay, I'm back. So, come on, guys. You don't have to be true. Just give me your opinion. Do you think that a company that has a bad social media marketing sell a lot of things? No, not much. No, in this time, no. Mm -hmm. But what about Coca-Cola? Do you think that they need like a lot of uh, social media? For sell for selling? No. No, because they already the product. I uh -huh. maybe but if it's a new product. Have, but they have like uh, before a lot of social media or before the medias there were like a company that invest a lot in advertising. Uh -huh. So they make like they have already send the, the way that they are. Exactly, that, that's a, I don't know, that, that's a very, very big company, well known. And even though, guys, Coca-Cola is one of, the, uh, one of the companies that are geniuses in advertising. And they yes. are still. So I think it was Gladys yeah. that perhaps this is more important in uh, new companies. Why Gladys? Can you repeat the question that you said? Yeah, you mentioned mm -hmm. that perhaps for new companies this is important. Why do you think that? Ah, yes, because like they they are they aren't known, mm -hmm. so they need to be making marketing. So it's really important, and and the thing that you said also, and the way that they they. Um, they manage their social media can can affect in a great way their their sales for good or for bad. Okay, thank you, Gladys. Do you guys agree on this? On Glad Gladys's opinion, I I agree. Okay, very good. And um, what is the role of a blog in media marketing? First of all, okay. what is what is a blog? Can anybody tell me? Like a web page when people can post anything. Okay. Do you know any company that handles blogs or any type of uh, business that handles blogs? No, but this is, uh, there is this social media uh, Tumblr that it's like blogs, mm -hmm. but it's not a company. But it's not? It's not like um, a company. Okay. So um, you already have an, an idea. So this is what we're gonna do, guys. I wanted to develop your own, um, your own criteria, your own way of thinking. Like I said, especially Salvadorian people, they talk about everything. 
we are experts about everything. We give opinions in politics. We give opinion in economy. We give opinion in the health industry, right? And you see that on Facebook, right? On social media. So we don't know. We don't know. About and we don't know anything. So guys, you don't need to know to give your opinion. So let's go ahead and spend the next five minutes with these two questions. Let's pretend that you have a business because everybody is trying to sell, right? Now you say. Now you see people that used to have a good job selling pupusas or selling hamburgers or selling whatever. So it is very important. Let's go ahead and handle these questions in the next five minutes, give your opinion. When we come back, I'm gonna choose for some volunteers. All right. So let's go ahead and accept the invite please and I'll see you back in. You're going to copy the questions. Yes, ma'am. I will. You. You're welcome. Thank you. Go ahead and accept it. I'm gonna send it right now. Can you? Tired, but here we are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's finally Friday. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> well, I have the questions in here and too. There are. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, let's how see. That? Uh, how does social media marketing influence the sales of a product service? Hmm. Well, it does a lot. It, it, it influences a lot. It influences it, a lot. Uh, it influences a lot because um, Because they they can make you need someone something that you don't. Sometimes. I think that allows uh, a product to be known by. Sorry if if you can hear my nephew, but it's crying because I don't know what what is happening with him. <laughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, I think that allows a product to be known by a uh, great number of people mm -hmm. sometimes it doesn't point because yeah. for example if the store is very well recognized there's only a lot of police recognized recognized Yes, I think just the same, yeah, but I think it's, it's pretty much important for the new companies. Yeah, if you open a um, new business or, or I don't know, maybe a, a little business like a pupuseria or whatever you want in, in, in this time, uh, the social media, uh, it's really important to use because you you are communicated your your product or your service and you uh, show the people uh, your facilities uh, for your maybe for your service if you have deliveries if you have uh, um, the best prices or the best product I think. What do you mean by facilities? Facilities to send the, to send or to, it's for uh, the facilities to, in this case is for the, the new, the new company or the new. Okay, but uh, what facilities, are you talking about like facilidades? 
Yes. It's... Okay. Let me help you with that one. Facilities is actually the location. For okay. example, uh, let me show you the facilities. Here you have the uh, conference room number one. Here you have the offices. Here you have the parking spot, parking lot. So that's actually the facilities. Okay. Right. Um, in case I think that what you want to say is that in order for the, the company to show, I don't know, what they have to offer or to show their, their what, what they offer. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. To get up. You. You're welcome. Yes, I agree. And also, I think that for new companies, um, this is like an a strategy that is like cheaper um, because they are starting a new a new company they're starting to sell new products uh, i i think uh for a, an inter entrepreneur entrepreneur mm -hmm. entrepreneur entrepreneur, uh -huh. entrepreneur is um easier to show the products in social media uh because because of the like the budget that they have for this advertising, they are like choosing some strategies that are Strate um, strategies, strategies that are like more. How do you say como alcanzables? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You got okay. reachable, reachable, reachable in the meantime. Uh huh. Yeah. Reachable, affordable, depends if you're talking about money or possibilities, affordable. Yeah, affordable, maybe. Mm -hmm. uh, because they don't have the budget or... or, or and other things. <laughs> but, don't worry. But the don't worry. Social media, what do you think about the social media, Roxana? Uh, we were talking that right now is very important that all companies have like a expert in this, in this, I don't know how to say like. Area? Perhaps. This area, <laughs> yeah, in this area. Maybe right now is if someone wants to study, <laughs> study something like that because it's like upgoing, I think, the, the, this career. Yeah. And you, um, Juan Carlos? Yeah. Ah, sorry, Roxana, sorry. Um, no, it's okay, Sara. <laughs> All guys. So little by little, people is coming back, and um, I'm gonna need some volume.